so we gon' win Knock me down nine times, but I get upset Look myself in the mirror, I said we gon' win Knock me down nine times, but I get upset What's up, you two? This your girl locked in Loaded I don't know I'm tired of shit I literally just got off work like 50 minutes ago. It's 10.50 p.m. I'm tired. I've been up since maybe 6.30, but I'm trying to be more active in my channel. Get shit shit popping. So, this video today is gonna be about how to adult better. But besides all that, I think we as adults can run our lives a little bit more smoothly if we one slow down and two prioritize better financially this book has been my savior it has been the sugar honey iced tea it has been my counselor it has been my therapist it has been my bank banker or whatever you want to call it bookkeeper whatever i think i got it at like family dollar it might have been three four dollars could have been cheaper than that i don't remember it ain't got to look like this i just like the quote that's on it because it lets me know i can do it even if it is on my time and what i use this book for i'm telling you i'm not gonna show y'all what's in it but I'm like flip through the pages so y'all can see. This saves me so many headaches, so many breakdowns, and so many headaches. So like, let's see. So like my first page was when I first started the job I'm at now. I wrote down when I started, what my shift was going to be, what my first couple of paychecks was going to look like, and... Yeah, like, I, I think I got an issue. The second page lets me know what my account numbers are in my bank and what I use, which bills I use with what account, if you catch my drift. So it got, like, my regular account when my direct deposit comes in. It has an account where I pay all my bills. Side note, if you guys have, like, accounts that you have to basically use, like, a routing and account number... Ask your bank if you can open up more than one checking account. I'm telling you, this shit is, oh my God. I'm so mad I never thought about it earlier. I literally have an account for everything. I have my main account where my direct deposit comes in. I have bills like my Verizon, my, my uh, electricity, my car insurance, and whatever else I need to pay. My gym membership, all of that stuff comes out of that account. And then I have one for groceries. I'm not, I can't just sit stuff to the side and then think I'm gonna remember it. No, I made my own account for groceries. So when I get paid, take my money out my account and then I put it with um, in a checking account for groceries and then I have my savings. So this little page just let me know what my policy numbers is and all that good stuff. So then, Another thing that helps me is actually each payday, I write down what I need to pay. So like on September 13th, I wrote down what I need to take out for rent, pay my children's place credit card, pay my car payments, and my renter's insurance. And then another page, wrote down for my youngest party. And then it's really like my doctor's appointments, now, tech savvy, if you can remember to put all that in your phone, you go to your calendar, whatever date you need to set it on, click the little plus sign if you got an iPhone, if you got an Android. I don't deal with that. That's the most wackest system in the world. Whatever, you'll figure it out. iPhones, go to calendar, click the plus sign, add whatever time you need to be there. Um, you can set an alarm to let you know a day in advance, two hours in advance, 30 minutes in advance. And then that just goes on. Like one of my other paychecks. Um, I'm secretly trying to plan a Disney trip. Oh, I forgot he's like a Disney trip for my oldest. He's turning a big one zero. It might be backwards. <laughs> I'm the big one zero. And I always made a mental note to myself. Whenever he hits a milestone, I want to try to do something big. I wanted to 
take him to Disneyland when he turned five. Financially, he wasn't cutting it. So now he's about to turn a big 10. I've never planned a trip before. So if y'all can help me with that, please. I'll give you my email and we can do a whole lot of chatting. I mean, but anyways, as you can see, it's just like, yeah. I write down everything. I write down the amounts, what my ending balance would be, and I go ahead and I check it off. So, it didn't mean for that to be so long and drawn out, but I'm telling you, like, writing things down is influential in my fucking life. Like, if I can just tell you, like, every time, let's just say, I and I, I ain't ashamed to say, it. if I ever had to borrow some money from somebody, they'll look at me like, in Michigan, you ain't gonna get nobody to let you borrow no damn money. That's just off rip. When I move to where I'm at now, it's like... You know, I'm going through this and that, trying to play catch up. You mind if I borrow woo woo? And I pull, I pull this book out, and they're like, "What are you doing?" I'm like, "I need to let myself know to pay you back, and with what check?" They like, "Girl, you don't need to do all that." I'm like, "Yes, how I was raised. Whenever somebody helps you, you always pay them back, cause you never know if you're gonna need it again." But, yeah, I don't want this video to be too drawn, long, drawn out. I'm just, it's just a informative video, a helpful video, a video for people like me that's always on the go. I got two kids. I'm in school. I work full time. One of my oldest is autistic, so I have to be on my P's and Q's so he can. And then my one-year-old is a cancer with the Leo's personality. So, boom, we be at it even though he won. Like, I kind of felt what Kevin Hart said in his stand-up. Doom a gobble, doom a gobble, doom. You black midget. I think that's what my, saying, my son be saying to me. You shut up, you brown fat. Okay, anyways, but yeah. So, get y'all one of these. Go to Dollar General, Family Dollar, whatever y'all got, wherever y'all at. Get one of these and leave me a comment. Like, subscribe, and I bet you, you're going to be like, thank you. Hello. All I really wanna see is up. I don't really need to be any dumb. All a bad bitch need is up. I got pants in the coop. Bussin' out the roof. I got pants in the coop.